Magics, and I'm doing a Draw My Life. So let's get started. Ooh, we have a long time. So I was born April 19th, 8.39 I want to say, and I was a hairless little baby. I'm cute. I'm cute. Don't mind that me, it's just, no. I was actually born six days earlier. Not seven, not eight, not nine, not, not, not nine. <laughs> <laughs> but six days earlier. That was my dad, who, so. <laughs> so I was born in California in Orange City. Well, and raised in California, in Orange City. Um, here's me. My mom, I mean, yeah, my mom, my grandma, and my uncle. I don't know why I made him smiley. And in my house, red, it was big, thank Lord, because we had one dog and, yep, ten cats. Ten cats. Ten, ten cats. Don't, don't ask. My mom was never really home when I was young. She was busy working as a bartender. She would be working at restaurants, parties, um, big, events. big events, you name it. Anything. But, so I usually hung out with my great grandma, who loved me very much and I loved her. She passed away when I was six though, so, it, but she lived to a great age. I, when I was home, so was my uncle David, and he gotta be so rude. Why he gotta be so rude? I had to, don't, don't, just don't. And he usually drank and, what? He'd usually drink and yell at me. Yeah. It, it, it didn't go so well. Then my eyes. I'd usually be with my mom or my dad. Since they weren't married yet. Hi. And when I'd be with my dad, I'd also be with my grandma. Who passed away not too long ago. Well, two years ago, I think. I think no. <laughs> Use my dad didn't, doesn't work. He never did because he actually has TBI from a car accident. I mean, he did, but he didn't work when I was born because of TBI. So I usually hang out with him. Yes, I know I look like Cinderella. Just, just don't say it. So we'd go to the park, a water park, a pool, anything. Now let's fast forward into the story. Okay, so when my grandma died, my uncle ended up kicking me and my mom straight out of the house. I drew this one, aren't you proud of me? No. I'm be quiet. Comment down below if you're proud of her or not, please do. It was, it was fast, so. So, he, he was really mean, and he kicked me and my family out. So I never got to live in that house again. So we ended up moving to Hemet. Hemet? Yeah, Hemet, with my grandma. And we ended up living right across the street from her house in a duplex, where, right, sharing a wall next to someone. Dang, we did that often, actually. Holy cow. And granted, their family was nice. Their daughter was a little older than me, but I was still able to play with her. And of course, there were stairs. I hate freaking stairs. Stairs are a potato's worst enemy. I'm a potato. My, You see my problem. The potato. That. <laughs> the potato. Um, this was about a potato. year, a couple of years later when I... Me and my family ended up moving because my mom's friend had lived lived in a new a different town, and we had visited that, that town, and it was we thought it was nice, so we ended up moving to a new town from my old town. So I left behind a lot of friends that I cared about, and I entered a new town called Pagosa Springs, where I Colorado, where I currently live today. I don't want to tell them where you live. Apparently live. Apparently live there. A year later, I was. Diagnosed with type one diet. I was diagnosed with type one diabetes, and I will. What is that? That's a hospital. Oh. And what is that? It's on the floor. It's, what is wrong? It's an IV thing. I was diagnosed with type one diabetes, 
And with yeah. diabetes, I had to deal with. <laughs> I had to deal with um. Shots, blood sugar, checking my blood sugar, which involved needles, which Ugh, didn't help when needles. I first had fear needles. Ugh, um, needles. Pumps, CGMs, which were glucose monitor monitors. Pump site changes, uh, high high blood sugars and low blood sugars, which high blood sugars, I really am going to explain this in the next episode, I promise, because I'm not explaining it now. Ketone strips, which I also have to explain in the next episode, or you can look it up, whatever you want, etc. Well, guys, that's part, we, that's part one of my Draw My Life. Comment down below if you want me to finish the story. Don't forget to... Give me a minute, give me a minute. I have this down. I have this written down. Give me a minute. You mean written. I no. wrote this down. I think I wrote this down, too. I'm mad at myself. Okay. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye!